our goal today is just to educate people about what the Northern Pass is, educate them about the uh, the health side effects of EMFs, which you know those come off AC lines that we already have, but this is a proposal for high voltage DC lines. Um, eminent domain. Educating folks about eminent, eminent domain. We've got a lot of uh, free handouts with. Um, resources online for folks to find out more information. Yeah. We're encouraging people to go on the uh, DOE's website and file their environmental impact statement. For this, that scoping period is still open. Um, what else are we what, up to what, what, here? what motivates you to come out on this hot day and do this? Um, my motivation for this would be it's absolutely alarming to me how many people, even in our community, I'm not talking about you know folks visiting our community, still really don't know what stop the Northern Pass means or stop the towers. So you know it's a for a group that's not funded, this is all you know our time, we're grassroots. It's really important to go person to person. These are our current towers. This is what they're proposing. Search has been in for over 20 years when Robert Becker wrote Cross Currents. There have been mm -hmm. plenty of people doing research on the uh, harmful effects of uh, micro radiation and um, it's affecting um, increased rates in childhood leukemias and other cancers and other problems. Okay? But that's yeah. been well documented. It's not just fly by night.